Hi, I'm Saad Khan. I've been working with actors as an acting teacher, as an improviser, and as a film director for many years now. And this video is about six things that will help you perform comedy scenes in movies. The first thing that you need to remember is be self-aware of what makes you funny. A lot of your friends might say, oh my god, I love the funny faces that you make, or those goofy expressions that you make by distorting your face, and you know, those funny weird expressions. But just by making these funny weird expressions isn't about you being funny in front of a camera to perform a comedy scene. Second thing, identify your own personal comedy character. What that means is for you to understand what your sense of humor is like. Is it dry or sarcastic? Is it quirky and shameless? Is it filled with double innuendos where you're always cracking those double meaning jokes? Who are you as a person and what kind of funny do you like? Once you've established that, then you know every time you read a script or a scene or a dialogue, you will use your personality to integrate itself into the character that you're portraying to make sure that you garner a comedic response from the audience. The third thing that I'm about to say might surprise you because I do so much improv, it's about sticking to the script as much as possible. Because comedy is all about rhythm and timing. Rhythm is your pace, the way you speak, fast or slow. And how you are able to mold that pace depending on the dialogue that you're saying based on the character that you're portraying. That was rhythm. Now let me talk about timing. What is timing? Timing is your ability to stick to a line. It's your ability to deliver a perfect punchline. Which means you know that there is a line that's been given to you as dialogue. And you can say it in different ways. But the moment you practice, the moment you understand that this nuance that you are creating for yourself is based on understanding timing, you will work on that line again and again and maybe once you have three very good variations of the same line, you show it to the director and maybe the director turns around and says, you, you know what, this timing works very well with the scene that we're performing now. Number four, learn to break down a comedy script. Your next question is, where do I find a comedy script? Well, here are a couple of websites that you can look into. Comedy is made up of two things, desperation and unpredictability. What that means is when you're performing a particular character and you've got lines or dialogues and you're practicing in front of a camera or in front of a mirror, then what you do is associate your character and the line to maybe understand that whether this is a desperate situation that you're in or whether this is an unpredictable scenario that you're trying to create for the audience. One of the best examples of how both these words, desperation and unpredictability, come in a scene is in this movie, The Hangover, where all of them are sitting in a car with a tiger and they're just desperate because they don't know what to do. And they're also making the audience laugh at unpredictable moments. Five, be committed and be still. Not committed on social media. I mean committed to the role that you're playing and to the environment and to the co-actor. How do you figure out that commitment? You figure out that commitment by first being present. Not reactive, but responsive. Which means when a line has been given to you by a co-actor, if you are responsive, you will listen attentively and then you will respond. When you are committed, and especially when you're doing a comedy scene, your co-actor knows, your director knows, because you are present. And the second one, and a very important one in this particular point, is being still. When I say being still, I mean fidgeting. Imagine while I'm talking to you, I keep doing this. If I keep doing this. If I keep weirdly touching my jacket, or I keep pulling my zipper up and down. Then you're gonna be like, oh my god, why is he doing that? It's so distracting, and at the same time, I'm not being still. Stillness is very important for you to be responsive. The moment you start fidgeting and moving around while doing a scene, especially if it's a comedy scene, you will realize that you've lost your co-actor, you've lost the audience, and you have lost the environment completely. The final point, point number six, is for you to effectively perform comedy in a movie. Is that you have to have fun and not try to be funny. When you're not having fun, then how will the audience have fun? If you have fun, then the co-actor has fun, the director on the monitor has fun, and everyone that's watching the film has fun. So guys, have a lot of fun and make sure that you share this video and subscribe. And I'm gonna be doing a lot more of these videos about acting, so I'm gonna see you guys on the other side.